Hi, hi, hi. Hello, everyone. So I wanted to bring this case over to you, um, show you a missing man. This is the image that we have for him, um, one of the pictures of him, right? So Walker Rogers is his name. Here's another picture. That helps show you without his glasses. And this is what he would be on. This is his Harley Davidson. It's red in color. They do not know the plate number. From what I've gathered, they have not figured out the plate number yet. This was a post by him. It says, I'm sorry, everyone. I just can't do it anymore. The pain has gotten too much for me to handle. Please don't blame anyone for my actions. I made this choice and no one, no one else. I've been hurting for a long time and I just can't do it anymore. I'm sorry. That's really concerning. That's, that's really, really concerning. So let me read the post to you. This comes from a cousin. It says, I've been avoiding posting everything on Facebook, but this feels like the last resource I have available. My cousin, Walker Rogers, is missing. He has a history of depression and has been through a lot recently. Uh, it's been over 24 hours since anyone has heard from him. A missing person's report has been filed. He was last seen in Wayne County, Indiana. He claimed he was headed to Texas to visit his father's grave when I spoke to him around 3.30 p.m. on Friday, but no one has seen or heard from him, and this may have been a misdirect to get us to stop looking for him. We haven't. If you see him, if you hear from him, if you know anything, I am begging you to let Marcy Gilmore, Laura Remley, myself, or the Rushville Police Department know. Edit to add, I believe that I was told his dad is buried in Knox County in Texas. Second edit, he is believed to be traveling on his motorcycle. It's a red Harley Davidson. I will find a picture to add to the post as well. Thank you everyone for helping. And the comment section states that somebody did go and check the, um, the grave, right? The the area that his father was buried to see if there was, if he would be there or if there was any sign of him there. There is no sign that he has been there. There was nothing left um, at, the, at the grave site at all. And there was no single track tire um, left. They said that you can see um, other tracks, right? This is another photo of the bike. Let me expand that for you a little bit. It's another photo. But they said you could see tracks because of the dirt ground um, there where the graves are at. And there is no single track that would be from a motorcycle. So um, I wanted to bring this to you. There are many more photos. I believe he is a firefighter um, is what I believe I have seen based off of looking at his site. Um, and I can, uh, like I said, I'll do a, another community post and show you more photos if we would like or see if I can get any further information. But please keep a lookout, share this, and I will um, be keeping an eye out. If I hear anything, I will definitely let you guys know. Thank you all very, very much. I'll talk to you guys very soon.